वेलकम यू ऑल टू द पार्ट सिक्स ऑफ सेमी कंडक्टर्स इन दिस सेक्शन वी विल बी स्टडिंग अबाउट जीनर डायोड एंड जीनर डायोड इज अ स्पेशल पर्पज डिवाइस एंड वॉट इज दैट पर्पज दैट विल बी स्टडिंग इन दिस सेक्शन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी शैल अंडरस्टैंड वॉट एक्चुअली जीनर डायोड इज जीनर डायोड इज अ डायोड इट सेल्फ बट इट इज हेवीली डोप्ड एंड इट ऑपरेट इन द ब्रेकडाउन रीजन राइट it is a heavily doped pn junction it operates in the breakdown region and we know that the breakdown region is in the reverse bias we have studied about the iv characteristics in that breakdown region we can see and at that breakdown region this zener diode works and the symbol of the zener diode is like this it is similar to the diode itself but instead there will be a, a z marking like this and this side is a p side and this side is the n side and uh, the iv characteristic of zener side i told you about the Uh, breakdown region and this is the breakdown region whenever the diode is reverse biased we find that at the beginning there will be a small current we know that when it is a reverse biased the charges flow due to the electric field and due to the electric field first minority charge begins to flow okay right so because small charges begins to flow and suddenly there will be increase in charges and why there will be sudden increase in charges because of the electric field do understand it is a heavily doped we are connecting the reverse bias reverse bias if we connect the electric field will be more the electric field will be more in a such a way that that electric field breaks the covalent bond between the atoms whenever the covalent bond between the atoms near the junction breaks again electron is we get electron as well as the holes means electron holes pairs of pairs are formed these electric charges are responsible for this sudden increase in the current so covalent bond breaks charges we get and there will be increase in the current that we at a particular voltage that voltage let me call it as zener voltage right so this is way the zener diode works now here right do understand and the special purpose of this uh, diode is that it works as a voltage regulator so what is the meaning of voltage regulator so at your home we find that the voltage fluctuation takes place right so that is unregulated voltage let me call it like this voltage might increase or decrease again might increase or decrease right and that increase or decrease will affect some of the devices which are present at our home and we know that to avoid that we are using certain kind of devices so instead of using the word voltage regulator let me use the word stabilizer that we will be using right there will be a computer there will be a tv there will be a refrigerator directly we are not connecting to the plug because we know that it may get damaged first we will be connecting to stabilizer and stabilizer to the uh, plug even though there is variation in the voltage the stabilizer will be damaged not uh, the device right which is of high cost we will be using usually will be using a stabilizer to it then right the same uh work the zener diode does here right okay let us understand again right zener diode as a voltage regulator so this is unregulated voltage okay for well, once again voltage regulator is a device which converts unregulated voltage to regulated voltage right variation voltage to the constant voltage that is how it converts now, right okay let us check it out how it how actually it converts right what is the circuit behind this let us understand it right so this is a unregulated voltage it is connected zener diode is connected and we know that zener diode whenever we hear about zener diode it should be connected reverse bias reverse bias means p side is connected to negative and n side is connected to positive with that a series resistance is connected okay why we are connecting let us understand this now right there is a zener diode and a series resistance so these two are connected to what we said here unregulated voltage and the device which you want to protect for example it may be tv refrigerator this is nothing but rl rl is load resistance right instead of remember rl let us remember okay it is a tv that it should not be damaged due to the fluctuated voltage you know okay let us take it uh, this is a load resistance and it and here we get uh, re regulated how we will get that you will be understanding now right so zener diode is used as a voltage regulator why it is used remember it has a special property the zener diode the voltage here it remains constant means vz that is zener voltage is independent of change in current even though there is change in current voltage does not change because of this property we are using zener diode as a voltage regulator so let me write here voltage drop across zener diode is independent of current flowing through it 
current is increasing now but voltage remains the same and it happens in the zener diode itself if you take a wire if current increases voltage increases now here right but in zener diode if the current increases voltage remains the same it is not increasing now right because of this property itself zener diode is used as a voltage regulator okay let us understand how it works now right so first of all what is under regulated voltage under regulated voltage might increase might decrease let us take two cases here first case if input voltage increases second case if input voltage decreases let us understand these two cases high low right okay what happens suddenly if input uh, voltage increases what happens now right this is unregulated if input voltage increases voltage increases here current through rs and zener diode increases right as voltage increases current also increases there right so current through series resistance and zener diode increases and as the current increases you know voltage also will increase voltage across series resistance will increase but voltage across zener diode will not increase why not increase because voltage across zener diode is independent of the current even though the current is increased in the diode what is not increased now here voltage is not increased right and voltage across series resistance increases but voltage drop across zener diode remains the same here voltage is not increasing current increasing but voltage does not increase here as voltage do not increase here voltage of the tv are also not increase and it will be safe from here right so think it over what happens if we, if the suddenly there will be increase in the voltage now right if there is heavy increase in the voltage this rs that is series resistance let me imagine that it is in the time it is like the fuse at your home now right when there is sudden increase the fuse uh, will break down now right you know the wire of the fuse will break down and it will safeguard the other devices at our home the same thing what happens here when the voltage increases this will get damaged but it remains the safe right because of the safety purpose we will be using this rs when rs get damaged okay there will be no flow of current now here we can understand that okay something happened in the uh, voltage now right so as voltage increases rs the breakdown or uh, this happens now here right so but zener diode is safe because voltage does not depend upon the current right so do remember since the voltage drop at the zener diode does not depend upon the current it is safe and the device which is connect connected parallel to it that is also safe right this is what happens here it when it increases same thing happens when it decreases right as voltage unregulated means it may be high or it may be low now here if voltage decreases current due to current through rs and zener diode decreases current decreases voltage decreases here but voltage remains same because it does not depend upon the variation of the current and hence again the, the, this across zener diode the voltage what we are getting here that is load resistance it it always remains a constant and because it remains constant we call it as regulated voltage and thus zener diode whenever or whatever be the change in the voltage the end voltage will be the same that is how the zener diode will converts unregulated voltage to the regulated voltage and this this uh, purpose is called as what we said here voltage regulator right one thing before i ever end with this do remember for voltage regulation for stabilization we require a device and that is the zener diode and the property of zener diode is whenever the current is increased or decreased or variation of current let me tell you here there will be no change in the voltage because of this property the zener diode is used as a voltage regulator right